Hey guys, it's Tammy. Welcome back to my channel and thanks for joining me. Well, it's Sunday and I always give y'all a thrift haul. So, I have one from the other day and one from today. I'm sorry the video is so late going up, but I spent the day with Jordan today and we went shopping and we went to lunch. So, I'll get on with the haul. I do have some things from the Dollar General and I do have some things from Costco, but I didn't bring them in here to do a haul on them because y'all don't really want to see Costco. I got rolls, I got candy, I got the lemon cakes again, yum. But um, I want to get on with the Goodwill haul so y'all can see what I got, the hard goods. I got this, and yes, this stuff came in it. But it's another apothecary jar. But look at it. I like the shape of it. Now that I see this, I'm not terribly fond of the lid. Jordan said it looks like the emoji. But I love the shape of it. And it was only $4.25. So that's mine. Then I got this to go on my coffee tea station. I think I'm going to put some tea bags in it, but it says have a sweet holiday. I mean, you know, do I have to use it for Christmas? I think it's cute. Maybe I'll put it away for next year. Um, and then I got this. I have two vintage um, glass bowls that match this, so I went ahead and got this for the cocoa bar as well. Maybe put the cocoa in this one. And $1.25. And marshmallows in this one. And that other little tin was also $1.25. But it opens like that. That would be great for marshmallows. Cute. So I got that. And I got... Okay, I've shown y'all everything. <clears throat> then I got these. These were three for four twenty-five. They're more <clears throat> more of the um, wax molded candles, and it actually says something. Evergreen scent, I think it says. But I just wanted them to go with my collection of molded candles. Alright, then I got two more pieces from the other day, and then we'll jump on to today. I found this. This was $3.25. This is Depression Glass 1930s, and I forget, Pearl and Oyster, I think is the name of the plate. I looked it up. $3.25. I just thought it was really pretty. And it's pink depression glass. Mine. Okay. Sorry. Just knock my Uggs. Alright. Then I got these. These I paid up for. But I couldn't help it. They were $3.25 each. Look at them. Now this is pink. It's kind of showing up red, but it's really pink. Almost a fuchsia, and it goes to pretty. It's at the, <clears throat> at the bottom, and then at the top, and they're hollow. They're hollow. They're solid, but they, they're really cool. Love them. Cool. Mine. All right. Now, it's time for today's haul. And I'm going to show you, I got some clothes for Yeti. He told me I don't like them. He hasn't even seen them yet, but he's complaining about them already. I got some pants for myself. Red, stretchy. I'm thinking I'm going to wear them tomorrow. I'm going to wear my own, I'm on the naughty list shirt because it's my last day before vacation. So, I think I'm going to wear them. Got to wash them. And see if they fit. Because, no, I didn't try them on. 
they're an extra, so they should fit. They're for big girls like me. <clears throat> Hello, Squeaks. All right. Now this, the rest I got for Yeti of the quotes. I got him this polo that is green and white stripe. And it's, uh, you know, polo. All the yellows, their shirts are three ninety nine, but today was yellow half off. And I got it yellow. So I got this one. I got a pink one. I got a yellow one. It's awesome. Look at that. Nice, nice. All for what a dollar and fifty cent ish. This one is um this is not polo, but it's polo. This is the, the cheaper brand of polo. And then I got a purple one. Oh, this one is a large. I'll wear it if he doesn't want it. And then I got and this is an L.L. Bean long sleeve. So I got that. I mean, winter's coming. It's going to be chilly. And then I got, this one is a Banana Republic polo. But I thought they were nice. I wanted to treat Yeti to some clothes. Oh, and then I got, this was a Joseph S. Banks. Or Joseph A. Banks. And it's it's nitty. I like it. I think it's pretty. It would nice with the pair of or um, jeans even. So there's that. All right. Then starts. I got this. You see that? I got another tub. I got to put this stuff away. All right, I got this. This is pretty sure this is federal glass. I think it's a refrigerator bowl. I paid two twenty five. There's no lid, but I thought I got you know that's pretty cool. Got that. Then I found this jar, and somebody's done like a little assemblage or a scene in here with their bottle brush, brush trees. There's two of them, and they're fake snow. But it's like, is it a snow globe or is it, what is it? But I can always reuse the snow. I can always reuse the brush trees. And this was 325 yellow, half off. So, yep. What do we say? Mine. Then I found these. This was just a dollar twenty-five. Push pins always come in handy here because the walls stink. All right. Then we got these. These were four twenty-five, and I paid four twenty-five. It is. They're in bad, bad shape, but I'm hoping that the um, barkeeper's friend and a magic eraser will TCB. You got the two little half ones and then the bigger one. Two of them for four twenty-five. Yeah, I've got a whole boatload of these, but need I say more? 
Blue corn flour. So we got those. Then I got this. This was $3.25 half off. I got another lantern. I needed the black one to go on my TV entertainment area because the other one's silver and I'd rather have two black ones. So I got that. Oh. Three twenty five half off. Then I found this and I have a plan, but we're gonna see. This was three twenty five half off. It's a basket with chickens and roosters and a metal handle that's soldered in place. Yes, I think so. I've got to hunt for some more baskets that will accommodate for what I want it to do. All right, I'm going to start putting some of this stuff. I had it in this basket. I'm going to start putting some of it back in here to put it away easier. It'll transport in the kitchen much easier this way. All right. Baskets is full. All right. Put it down here for now. All righty. Then, the, the one, I think one last odd thing. Nope. This was eight pieces for five twenty-five. Half. Off. What is wrong with my throat? Half off. Blue enamel ware. That's a big old coffee cup. But we got that. Ugh. All right. I got. One. I used to have this. Two. Three. plates and again they were uh, eight pieces for 525 yellow half off I'm gonna be able to find another bowl and I know that I will find some more of the cups all over the place but I do have some white ones I, I don't know I think I have four I think I have two but that's really cute for a country table really cute so we got that. And I think I have one more thing from the thrift. And then after that, I've got some Dollar General stuff. This I paid $3.25 for. It's a fan. It works. Uh, I got it for my bedroom. And you know, I'm not hip on the pink, but as long as it's a fan, I'm happy. So we got that. And that is all of the thrift haul. So I'm gonna put this over here. Awesome. Now, it's not a lot of cool stuff, I promise. I got some socks. These are warmer, cushy socks, and I paid five bucks for these at six pair, and I've actually got a pair of them on right now, because I wore my Uggs. And then I got these, this is 12 packs, and this was also five dollars. You got six black and six white, and that is helpful for work. Then I got 
the Velcro, and it's a core project coming up for myself. Then I got some... <laughs> I ain't doing dishes for Christmas. We're gonna get paper plates so we can put them in the fancy plates. I ain't doing dishes for Christmas. I wanna spend time with my family. I don't wanna be in the kitchen washing tons and tons of dishes. I got this for the bathroom. I have a tissue box, a Union Jack cover to go over this. So, bathroom, tissues, by the way, I don't remember how much. Oh, here we go. Okay, the tissues were a dollar. The cutlery was three dollars. Oh, it don't matter. <coughs> I got these for the CAT for Christmas. <laughs> and then I got these, but you don't want to shake it for the big dogs. Not for my babies. My babies have their own, and it's in the other room already. I haven't brought it in here. So that's my Dollar General haul. Um... I do have some really cool Costco stuff. I got candy. I got Godiva. And I got... I can't remember the other one. I'm sorry. But I got some yummies. And y'all y'all are going to see the spread all laid out. Oh, and I got the... I got some car crackers. And I got some cheeses. And I got some meats. Just for, you know, little snackies around the house. I mean, like, kept telling myself, I'm off next week. I can eat that as, you know, as like a lunch, a little meat and cheese with crackers. And, I'll, you know, it'll be content. And it's it'll be good through, you know, New Year's Eve anyway. Um, let's see. I got the little lemon bites. Remember I got those lemon bites before? Big tub of M&M's because I wanted to put M&M's in my bubblegum jar. I just want M&M's in it. Um... We got a big, big, big tray of uh, shrimp, and we're going to have that for Christmas. The, the boys took that home with them. Um, I can't remember what else. But you will see. It's all laid out. It's going to be all laid out. But that's it, guys. Until next time, um, I am going to do a friend mail Christmas Eve opening. I have quite a few friend mail packages that I've thank the people that sent them to me, but I told them that I would like to open them up on Christmas Eve. So I'm going to do a video of that for opening up for Christmas Eve for my friends. So I thank you all so much for sending them and the cards that I've received as well. I thank you very much. It makes me feel very special. I love y'all to pieces. Have a safe holiday. If y'all don't get to come back and watch until after the holiday, I hope you have a Merry Christmas, or I have had a Merry Christmas, and a Happy New Year. But until Christmas Eve, that's Tuesday. I don't know if I'm going to do, I don't think I'm going to do a thrift haul on Tuesday. I'll do the friend mailbox, and I might, might, might do a Christmas truff, uh, trifle. I'm going to do a Black Forest trifle. Let me know if y'all want to see that. And if you do, then I'll video it when I make it. But that's it. Until next time, please subscribe, share, comment, and like. Peace.